Hey guys, Kevin here. When the urge for chocolate cake strikes and you don't have the time or energy to drag out the electric beaters, you can always mix and microwave your cake right in a coffee mug. I've been experimenting with this cup of chocolate cake for several days now, and I think I've come up with a very good recipe for it. To start, grab a coffee cup, spritz a little vegetable spray into the cup, and then add a quarter cup of self rising flour. And you can find self rising flour in any supermarket. Then add two tablespoons of granulated sugar and two tablespoons of unsweetened cocoa powder and a half teaspoon of baking powder and just a pinch of salt. Then grab a fork and mix all of these dry ingredients together. How easy is this? Then add one tablespoon of melted butter and a quarter cup of whole milk. Also add just a little splash of pure vanilla extract. And then mix again. We just want to get all of the dry ingredients wet. There, we're all mixed. Now throw in, oh, a few chocolate chips. These are semi-sweet chocolate chips. And stir those in. And then throw a few more chocolate chips right on top. This goes into the microwave for 50 seconds to one minute. I'll come back when the cake is ready. Okay, our cake has baked. I actually had it in the microwave for about 90 seconds. And I threw a few more, I don't know if you can see, but uh, I threw a few more chocolate chips on top. So now we can decorate it, although you, we don't have to, but I'm going to decorate it with a little confectioner's sugar because why not? And then we are ready for a taste. This would be really good with some ice cream on top. And in fact, while this is hot, if you throw ice cream on top, the ice cream will melt right into it. Delicious. Yum. Another bite. Oh. It's heaven. A chocolate cake in only 90 seconds in the microwave and in a coffee cup. Now that is music to my ears. Well, I hope you'll give this cup of chocolate cake a try. I also hope you'll subscribe to my YouTube channel. There's a little subscribe button over here somewhere. And I hope you'll leave a comment below. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I'll see you next time with another delicious recipe. Bye for now.